I'll do, uh, do the protocol that's required by myself um, to respectfully uh, acknowledge my uh, elders um, and protocols of my own people. So I'll, I'll um, do the formalities and I respectfully uh, open this conference and um, welcome you all to your, your country. I'd also like to, as a part of the process and protocol, is to uh, acknowledge all these other Aboriginal people, uh, nation groups that have come here as part of the conference today, and respect your ancestors and elders as well, and thank you for attending. One other, one other aspect I'd like to do, um, doing Welcome to Country, is also take the opportunity to um, uh, inform people about what is your your nation's opinion on um, they all, all things relevant. Um, in relation to um, you know, the, this, this conference and, and how important research and knowledge is, um, it's pivotal to your Yorta Nation and it's, it's, uh, it's catch cry that's been crying out for, for a long, long time about um, respect of the natural environment and how pivotal that is to our existence to keep that environment healthy, having the clean water. Uh, how you know how fundamental it is to um, our existence, and that's when I say our existence, I'm talking about uh, all Australians. Um, now the philosophies around understanding that as Aboriginal people, um, and you're, you're in particular in this case, you know, it's been core to our uh, continual survival in this, in this country uh, for thousands and thousands of years. Um, that just didn't happen because. You know, it was by chance. Um, Yorta Yorta people have built up this symbiotic relationship with this country and in the natural environment in order to be able to respect it in a way that sustains us and we sustain it. Now, now long come European um, you know, occupation um, over a bit over 200 years ago and that value that come with that society and uh, understanding of the natural environment just wasn't there. Now we've seen the evidence. Uh, this research has proven that. Um, how much damage being done in this country. And uh, you know, we 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 have been saying that we've we've got this information that you know, a trial and error research, if you want to call it that, uh, over thousands and thousands of years of intimately you know, living and depending on this environment. So we've got information, we've got knowledge that we need to impart um, into today's way in which we develop strategies, management plans um, that's needed in order to best understand this environment and keep in play um, an asset that should be there for all Australians, not just now but into the future. So that's something we want to do. Um, we've been uh, again, you know, as we all do, we battle politics, changes of government, you know, changes of policy around the way in which uh, governments see or utilise um, these types of issues uh, for leverage to get you know, public votes. Um, we're not interested in, in that. You know, as I said, we've had this relationship with the natural environment for thousands of years, as, and we've, we're still here after thousands of years. So in itself, you know, there's a there's the attitude we should adopt and have an approach to uh, how we respect this natural environment and what we should do as researchers, natural resource management agencies, as Chris said, how we implement. Um, and we can get that from people like the Yorta Yorta people and other nation groups around, around Australia. It's just a matter of um, you know having, having that epiphany and the light goes on and, and sees and understands exactly our spiritual relationship with the land that's connected to that physical side of dependency. But, you know, we adopt those attitudes we've, we've got and those, those relationships, that knowledge into um, you know, our strategies, as like I said, and our plans, and we should be, get, be able to get it right. Because it, um, I think a lot of it is, uh, as researchers, you, you, you fundamentally understand the value of, of longevity in research. You know, long time, long term, long, long, long sort of, um, uh, Knowledge gathered from, from uh, you know, studying and, and researching, monitoring. Um, that can only come with time to get a, get a better understanding. And we all know this environment out here. It's it's so uh, 
So uh, they're fragile in, in, in the way it exists, um, but it's the balance that's required. And again, uh, you ought to the people that have got that knowledge. It's a fundamental philosophy and way we've um, respected it. So uh, I'd, I'd, like to, I'd like this, this sort of stuff, Keith, um, uh, the research stuff, and I'm inviting the researchers in to uh, you know, be a part of this and how pivotal it is to the future of um, natural resource management. And uh, as Bruce will know, and, and others from Parks Victoria, um, we've got an opportunity with Yorta Yorta now um, in joint management of the national parks in this region and in the Crown Land areas. And particularly in water, Keith, uh, we all know how, how pivotal again water is to the whole wetland system. So um, we're excited about it. We're looking forward to the whole relationship. We've got some other ability there now. We're building capacity and uh, Ray Ahmed heads up a team there of uh, Yorta Yorta Rangers but the Yorta Nation, we've, we've also got um, you know, the relationship with uh, CMA, Golden Road Catchment Management Authority that we've been building on for some time. Parks Victoria now sits with Yorta Yorta Nation under the one roof. I don't think that's been done before anyway. Um, so we're taking the steps you know, to um, build the capacity, the knowledge and support a team approach to getting this right. But it goes back to the official ecological knowledge as well. We need to get that included in the way we do research and we understand the landscape and the natural environment. So I'll leave it at that. Um, as, as Keith knows and everyone else knows, I can talk for hours under the water too. <laughs> um, but again, uh, welcome to your country and enjoy the next few days. Thank you.